I got a call from a collector and um, they were basically harassing me and uh, disclosed third party information to family members. So I knew that was wrong. I have my rights, the FDCPA gives me my rights. So I decided to contact Manning Law. When Krista came to us uh, and described the abuse from the subprime auto lender that she had gotten her auto loan from, uh, the first thing we did was investigate. And what we found was that uh, this lender had been previously sued by the Attorney General in the state of California. Krista came to our law firm because we're a firm dedicated to protecting consumers and enforcing consumer rights. The Manning Law Firm was on my side for sure when I wanted this harassment to not happen to somebody else. Uh, the first thing we did was file a complaint, uh, go to court, and have a judge issue an order to stop this conduct. I felt that uh, they took it one step over the line that uh, made me feel, like I said, invaded. I didn't, I didn't feel that that was right, and I felt embarrassed, and I felt uh, sad because it concerned my grandma, and my grandma's much older, and I knew it wasn't right. We applied to the court for a, an emergency temporary restraining order which the court granted and which the court subsequently converted into a preliminary injunction. We were able to get her car loan forgiven. Uh, the, the subprime auto lender that violated her rights paid our fees and she received cash. I think they, they went that extra step to make sure it doesn't happen to anybody again. It was a win-win from all perspectives and even really from the perspective of the public because uh, this lender is now going to be much less likely to violate the rights of uh, auto borrowers. I would definitely refer Manning Law. Um, the reason being is because it, the consideration and the, the genuineness and the humbleness that you guys bring to your clients to want to help them genuinely, um, I think is a plus.